What's up? It's Butch from Afternoons, 94.3 Loudwire. Check us out 3 until 7 every afternoon. And, uh, well, we've been getting to know our Colorado Ice players all year long. Today, obviously, if you can't tell, we got a little bit of a special treat for you. Not necessarily a player today, but maybe the best looking guy from the team. Yeah? Yeah, that's kind of what I thought. We got Glacier here, and we've also got Sweetie the Ear of Corn from the Loveland Corn Roast Festival. Sweetie can talk, Glacier doesn't have a voice. So Sweetie will talk to us a little bit. Everything that Glacier wants to say, he's gonna have to act out. So what's up, Sweetie, how you doing? Not much, man. Thank you so much for having us today. Yeah, and you... uh, this is beyond my comprehension, actually, <laughs> being here in a studio with the star, actually I think the star of the team here, Glacier, and um, I'm very pleased to be here. Thank yeah. you, Butch, for having us. You got it. You might have to do a little bit of uh, interpreting for me, if you will. I, I know that mascots kind of speak the same language, so you we might do. have to help we me do. out with we're, we're, we all come from. We're all cut from the same cloth. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. It you, you looks like you might have come from a different sort of cloth. A Yours is green. yellow and green, and his is white. But. Hey, we're not racist around here, like that, right? Thank goodness. All right. Yeah, no kidding. No Donald Sterling action <laughs> in this studio. <laughs> so, uh, we always ask the players when we get started where you guys come from and, and who you guys are. Tell me a little bit about who you are. We'll start with you, sweetie. Well, I'm uh, actually, I, I was raised in uh, East Loveland. A little bit east of Loveland. That's where my family is from. And uh, which to me it was a natural progression to, to be yes yes to be mm -hmm. part of the Corn Roast Festival. It's been, it's been a, a, a desire of mine since I've been a little little husk, and uh, so so uh, you know it, it's uh, that's kind of those are my roots. Okay, that makes sense, Glacier. Where do you come from? North Pole. Yeah, that's kind of what I figured. How is it up there? Cold, yeah, I bet. But you got some nice fur, so you, you hang in there nicely, I'm sure. How old are you, Glacier? How long you been around? A long time? Since. Or are you just a I kid, a rookie, medium? <laughs> since the ice started? Since the ice started? Okay, I got you. Yeah, this is gonna be this is gonna be interesting, huh? Yeah, we got to work on our sign language skills, there, buddy. He's he already told me that if I don't understand, I think that's what he was saying is that he was gonna whack me in the head with his snout. Is that a snout? Yeah, uh, watch out for it. Doesn't look like I'd like to get hit with it. So, Glacier, you're a part of the ice. Uh, sweetie, I know I've seen you at some ice games. Tell me about what you think of the ice so far, and uh, what, is, it, is it a championship year for the team? I believe so, Butch. Uh, everything that, that I can tell, you know, football's really not my specialty, but uh, from what I see, uh, the team is, especially this last game, made some outstanding uh, plays and, and really kicked some butt. And we're looking forward to them uh, going all the way this year. Yes, sir. Glacier's more involved with your look, I think, than he is with the team. Team, <laughs> yes. Championship this year, Glacier. Well, he gets pretty excited about this stuff. Yeah, pretty jazzed. So. Okay, yeah, we'll take your word for it, man. He does. Okay, so so enough about football and enough about who you guys are. We want to we wanna get to know you on a deeper level, if you will. That's what we do with all the players every week. So I want to know, you guys are mascots. You got any secret talents? Well, that's hard to say, Butch. It, it depends on the day. Um, <laughs> a lot of times, you know, I'm a pretty shallow guy. So uh, <laughs> for the most part, I've got... You know, it depends. It depends on the situation. I'm situationally talented. Okay, well, we're in a situation right now that's a pretty tight room. It's a tight one. Yeah, do you got anything you can show us in here, or is this one of those situations where you're just going to be a shallow guy? Well, I think this is one of those situations where I think cooler heads ought to prevail, and I think I ought to just be a little more shallow. Now, my partner here, that's a different story. You talk about talent. This guy's got more talent than, than I've ever seen. Again, we're in a small room, Glacier. You can't be doing your flips or anything like that that we know you got, but you can do something, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> Say what? <laughs> yeah! <out>. Yeah! <laughs> now, now, how about that, huh? That wasn't too bad. That wasn't too bad. Why are you wiping my shoulders off? You brush your own shoulders off, buddy. There you go. He does. I, I've got a pretty lack of mobile. I'm not very mobile. <laughs> we see that. Plus, there's a mirror ball that you're going to run into, oh, and that'll okay. hurt your little, your little corn head. We don't we want don't, that. No. <laughs> All right. So now, 
We've all, along with going what we've done with the players, it seems like every week we meet a new player and every week that we meet a new player, we meet a new best dancer on the Colorado Ice team as well. So maybe you guys think you have a best dancer on the team, but I'm assuming that since they all think that they're the best dancer, that you guys probably think that you could take them into dance up. You got some dance moves you can show me, sweetie? Well, actually, since it's a little tight for space, my, my specialty is the curly shuffle. And, and right here, it's a little tight. I can't, I can't bust it out, so I, I'm sorry. But, uh, you know, I, I can I'm, I kind of move. It depends. I'm a situational <laughs> situational dancer, too. Yeah. So, uh, depending, it depends. Yeah, I, I see. Yeah, this isn't your best specialty either. Glacier, show us some moves. <laughs> Look at that guy go. I'm telling you. That's not bad for the... Yeah, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> it's not bad for the room that you've got. All right, uh, so so uh, I, I have always wondered, it, it, this looks like a, an uncomfortable situation to sleep in, so it's always made me wonder, I'm a rock guy, what, what, do, you, what do you guys sleep in? Is it... Are you able to take off your husks? Are you able to uh, <laughs> well, just go down to it, just the cop? It, it, <laughs> <laughs> Well, Butch, you know, it, again, that's situational. It's, uh, it, de it depends on the situation as far as what I sleep in. <laughs> it, uh, you know, depends on how cold it is, how hot it is, and uh, uh, it, it could, uh, yeah. Y y you get my drift. Yeah, I got you. Okay, Glacier. Yep. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the <Yeah>. look? <laughs> okay. That, that, that's fine. As long as you keep your fur on, we're fine. Well, <laughs> it doesn't go anywhere, right? Yeah, we're good. We're good. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Do you guys do you guys have a favorite? We're, we're a rock station, so it doesn't necessarily have to be a rock band. But do you guys have a favorite singer? Somebody you like to listen to? Favorite band? You know, I'm probably a little older, as you can tell, from, than most of you. But uh, I'm an old Almond Brothers fan, actually. I remember growing up on the farm. Yeah, that, that uh, you know they that uh, we used to listen to a lot of Almond Brothers. They back play then. the Almond Brothers on the Loveland Farms, huh? Yeah, they do actually. It makes sense. Okay, the Glacier, yeah. what you got? Yeah, that's what I thought. He's a Gene Simmons <laughs> kiss guy. He's there just a go. pop. He's just a pop. <laughs> I know if you had some blood, you could probably spit it out and blow fire and all of the stuff that he does too. You go. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> not sure. Not sh <laughs> I'm not sure what that was all about, but there you go. There's another secret talent. Glacier is very good at spitting out water. Yeah, we should call you Waterfall. If you ever have a kid, if there's a mini glacier, we're going to call him Waterfall. Well. No, you don't like that name? Ice Cube? Oh. Yeah, that's better. Okay, yeah. there you go. All right. So, uh, do you guys have any other, any other talents as far as sports go? Do you play any sports, sweetie? You know, um, again, uh, given my my genetically modified uh, body here, I uh, no, I'm, I'm pretty limited as to what I can do. So, yeah. you know, I, I yeah, I can ride a bike, ride bike, and um, you know, stay in shape. But other than that, it's it's pretty limited. And uh, you know, I'm I'm just here for everybody else's enjoyment. <laughs> Makes sense. You don't look very tasty, so at least you're nice to look at. Thank you, Butch. I'll yeah. take that as a compliment. Yeah, that you. is a compliment. You are a good-looking piece of corn. Thank you. Yeah, Glacier. I bet you've used that line many times, Butch. <laughs> <laughs> Glacier, do you play any sports? All of them? Basketball, basketball. You're a you're a football guy, though. I mean, you 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 hang out with the ice all the time. I'm assuming you play football. If you if you did play football in a game, what, what position would you play? Kicker, really? The guy that gets no credit, huh? Did you take that? You kind of seem like the guy that needs to be front and center. You'd be the first kicker that was the star of the team, for sure. All right, you mentioned something about basketball. We've taken all of the players that we've interviewed upstairs for a little tournament with our mini basketball hoop. You guys want to participate? Can't wait. All right, let's go upstairs and play. Let's do it. Five shots, Glacier. He lit the ball. And he got taken out by a dart. That's all right. Oh for one. Oh for one. Glacier set. <laughs> 
Wonderful. All right, let's bring in Sweetie. He's gonna he's gonna try it now. He can fit in here. Sweetie, you know the rules already. I heard you, Butch. All right, let's do it. That's I'm all sorry. right, Glacier, come on, come on back in here, Glacier. All right, we got Sweetie. Go see him at the Loveland Corn Rose Festival this summer. Thanks a bunch, buddy, for coming in. My Glacier, pleasure. Go see him at the Ice Games, one of the best mascots in the IFL right here. Glacier, thanks for coming in, buddy. Okay, and you'll, oh, just one, one last thing. You'll also see me at the game on the 17th. Loveland Chamber of Commerce is sponsoring that game, so uh, come on out. Should be a lot of fun. Looking forward to seeing you. Glacier will be there, too. Thank you, guys.